Hey, what's going on guys? It's me addicted to MC and today I wanted to do a video tutorial since I very recently upgraded my computer. So now I can play more games that are graphically intense like Mortal Kombat X and Fortnite. Or at least games that require a dedicated GPU that's powerful enough. So yeah, while I was playing Mortal Kombat X, I noticed that Anytime I started the game up, it would start in 800 by 600. And I saw that <clears throat> a couple of other people were having this problem too. And I eventually fixed it. So I wanted to show you guys the process of fixing it. Alright. So first, um, what you want to do is you want to go into like the start menu, the Windows start menu. You can um, you choose either the classic shell or the actual Windows start menu. And then you can search it up like this. We're going to search up percent. Percent. Alright, and if it doesn't start showing up, then click out of that and hold the Windows button and press R. And then type in percent app data percent. Enter. And it's going to bring up the app data for, um, it's going to bring the app data and then it's going to be in the roaming folder for all of your games. You want to scroll down to MK10 and right here we've got the options configuration, alright? You want to download Notepad++ in order to do this next part. Because, um, what I found out was, um, this right here was an INI file that couldn't was a read only. It couldn't be edited. It didn't look like this. It had like some green stuff and some some different colors. So um what I did to fix this was I copied all this down. Oh, actually I would be control A, control C, and then I went into a new um document for Notepad Plus Plus. I pasted it all down. Then I went to file Save as options, and you want it to be um a dot ini file or an msini. It's right here, msini, and then you click save. But I'm not gonna save it because I'm already happy enough with this. So yeah, that's um pretty much all you need to do. If um if it's not working that well, then um. Mm. Well, I don't know what else to do, because that's, that's the way I figured this out. Um, there was also something that I saw in, um, in the, um, in one of those Steam discussions. It said to, um, hold up, it said to go to properties in this game, and then, um, updates, and to disable this enable steam cloud synchronization for mkx now it didn't really do much for me so um if it helps you out then untick this but i'm gonna retick this because i want this all to go into the cloud so yeah if this helped out um please leave a comment telling me how much it helped out so yeah um, see you guys in the next video bye